Bonjour tout le monde. Je vous remercie d'être ici en cette journée qui nous donne à la fois un sentiment de tristesse et de fierté. Merci également, lieutenant-colonel Gauthier, pour cette belle présentation. Distingués anciens combattants, chers membres de la délégation, chers amis, c'est un honneur d'être avec vous ici au mon monument commémoratif de guerre du Canada et à la tombe du soldat inconnu pour souligner le 75e anniversaire du raid sur Dieppe. Et c'est un privilège d'assister à cette commémoration historique avec notre délégation canadienne qui revient tout juste de la France. Nous souhaitons un bon retour à la maison à tous les membres de la délégation. Nous espérons que vous transmettrez votre expérience unique à vos concitoyens canadiens. Je tiens aussi à remercier nos anciens combattants ainsi que les militaires présentement enrôlés qui sont parmi nous aujourd'hui. Votre engagement à nous protéger, à assurer notre sécurité est typiquement canadien. Vous incarnez ce qu'il y a de meilleur au pays. Nous vous remercions et nous vous serons toujours reconnaissants. A few weeks ago, I had the immense privilege of meeting a fine gentleman by the name of Stanley Hugh Edwards, who's here today. Stanley was a proud member of the 14th Canadian Army Tank Regiment. We chatted while I was in Calgary. He told me about his life and about his time at Dieppe. And in his story, I saw reflected the strength of all those who took part in the Dieppe raid 75 years ago. Boys forced too quickly to become men, men of tremendous bravery and fortitude dedicated to country. Men who battled impossible odds with courage and hope and who witnessed such a great loss of life. Thousands captured and killed, Canadian families forever altered, parents, siblings, spouses, and children left heartbroken. My friends, we often learn more about ourselves in our losses than in our victories. We grow, we persevere, we learn hard truths. The Dieppe raid was a devastating engagement for Canadian troops and for their loved ones back home. But ultimately, our soldiers learned lessons that would help secure their victory two years later on the beaches of Normandy. For those lessons, we look back on the Dieppe raid with unshakable pride. To our servicemen and women, past and present, thank you for your unwavering defense of the values we hold dear as Canadians. And thank you also to the families and caretakers of our brave veterans. Your service is important and it will not be forgotten. This year, 2017, Canada 150. It gives us the opportunity to remember a number of important milestones. The 100th of Vimy, Hill 70, Passchendaele, and the 75th of Dieppe. Today, we honor those who fought with such grit and valor on the beaches of France. <laughs> As we sit here in the rain, thinking how uncomfortable we must be these minutes as our suits get wet and our hair gets wet and our shoes get wet. I think it's all the more fitting that we remember on that day in Dieppe, the rain wasn't rain, it was bullets. As we stand here 75 later with this duty and this act of remembrance, It is all too fitting. Today and every day, we recommit ourselves 
for the pursuit of peace and justice for all. Today and all day, we remember.